Hello, my name is Niyamuda and welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, in today's tutorial, we're going to... Alright, so in this tutorial, we're going to be replicating this design by D. Devon. I found it on Pinterest. Alright, so today is the beginning of our um, GBD design challenge. So this is the task to replicate this design. Alright, so let's go. Without further ado, let's begin. So this is the exact size we'll be using. So I'm gonna go over right here. I'll go over right here. I'll just make it white. Alright, so I'm going to bring in the design. So we'll use it as a guide. I'll put it there. So first I want to bring in this image right here. Alright. Okay, so this is the image, and um, I'm going to make it like this. Uh, let's go. Mm. All right. Let's not worry too much about the image for now because all right all right so that is that so um, right here you're gonna be seeing um, Instagram stuff but let's look for the brooch if it's this guy here Let's try to um, okay. Let's rotate it like this. Let's drag it. At least let's make it bigger. All right. Based on what I see, this color. Is going to be this okay? Yeah, I'm gonna send it to the back, all right? All right, so um, the other stuff you can see here, like this Instagram TVD icon, okay? So, this is the Instagram TVD icon, um, it's like this. Right, then uh, copy it and put it there. Put it there. Okay. And we'll copy the bigger one and put it behind the lady. Right. Okay, so oh, I can bring this lady to the front. No, I'll send this guy to the back. Then I'll send this guy. I'll send this guy to the back. Oh, sorry. Alright. Then, um. Alright, so we're gonna see some stuff. It's there. Don't worry. Um. This cushion. So let's go. Let's bring in this. We can use it. We can use this shape to actually do the stuff there, All right? But if you don't want to use it, then you have to go and download a paper effect. Um, which of them can we use? So I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use this. Okay. So once you've gotten it. Put it here. Once once we've gotten it, just change the color. Alright, so the first one is blue. As you can see here, it's a barrel blue. Okay. Like this. So just put it somewhere there. Okay. And we have we have three. So 
or just do this copy bring this one here so this one is going to be green right so this is called not exactly it so we'll bring it this color like a lemon right then um, the next one is a purple right so we'll bring it here um, the purple is what we got from the Instagram right then uh, after that there is a shape also so this guy also will copy it I'll bring it here too but this time it's going to be shrinked here all right so let's go and get the text so if you check very well the first one is going to be discussion all right so let's go so we'll go here all right discussion sorry so based on what we have here um from the u to the s there is a break like this okay so the font it's um uh we'll use a vertical okay and um it's perfect it's perfect so let's go all right so remember it's a dark background so the color is going to be a white color all right okay all right so the next one is the next one is this guy here break down so let's go copy break down so break down all right so i'll put it right there the next one is discussing the newly released track so let's go in discussing the newly discussion the newly release um track all right so we just adjust it all right so we'll try to increase the line spacing and um all right perfect all right so this is instagram so we're gonna break it like this easter then gram so let's go so go instagram so break it from here and put it right there okay so the color this time around is going to be here um dark yellow which is this right here all right so the text color is going to be black right then uh, we have date over there so to get the date we just um, bring one of these text and we'll stretch it out so let's see the date first um friday 12th may 6 30 pm so let's go so write it here friday 12th may and there's a dash line sees 30 p l all right so that's it so we put a background the background should be black and let's try to make it the padding up down everywhere let's make it okay um we could even remove it <coughs> so remove the background remove the background and um, centralize it here and bring in this guy so bring in this guy we would um, adjust it like this okay all right and put it there so we can go ahead and bring this information to the front like this so this guy is going to be black okay this guy is going to be black then this guy 
<coughs> we're gonna go over here and then I'm gonna go to color. We're going to highlight the CSPM. I'll change the color to yellow. Alright, so that's done. Um the other information at the bottom there is um original J O A. So at original underscore J O A. Alright, we'll put it at the middle there. Alright, so if you are following this tutorial, I want you to like this video and share it. Share it to your friends and our families. Let us learn together. Alright, so if you look very carefully at the design, there are, there are other stuff there, so it's not finished. We have um, a circle JOA and then a, an inscription around it. But then there's, there's this stuff here. Don't worry. Let's see. Don't worry. So we'll bring this like this. So let's get it. Don't worry. Alright. Okay. Alright, so we're going to get something that we're going to use and to surround that text. Mm, where are you? 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We use this guy. Alright, let's use this guy. So let's just make it white. Alright, so this is not perfect. You could get other others you could use. Alright. I'll just go lock it here. Um then we have some other information here. I shall bring this guy in. So we have this last information here. All right, the color is going to be this guy. Okay, it's going to be here. All right, so inside it is going to be an inscription. But let's not bother ourselves too much about that first. Let's go and check what is there. Um, So this is an image I can see there. Mm, I'm going to try to use this guy. The color should be black. Alright, so so basically it's a circle and uh, a circle. Okay, so let's get um, this circle. So we're going to go to curve. I'm going to call this around the circle. All right, I'm going to um, kind of reduce it. All right, reduce it. All right, reduce it. All right, I'm going to bring this guy and we'll rotate it. Rotate, rotate, rotate. So it should be 180 minus. I'll bring it there. All right, and. Um, we have some other stuff around, so we'll bring this guy here. Uh, go to circle, we'll click on this, we'll uh, reduce the opacity. And then <coughs> we'll go over to stroke, just put one, two, three, all right? Then we'll go over to, um, I think that's all. So we can come here and we'll adjust it here. But if you notice very well, some of the some of the parts of the logo they are not showing properly. So um, I'll just reduce it like this. 
and I'm going to go to erase color and I'm going to erase some part of it where are you so erase color I'm going to do this take this guy hat take this guy hat take this guy hat take this guy hat and all right so that same stuff will duplicate it and we'll put it if you look at the middle there's something like that also so I'll put it at the middle there all right so that is it so we are done replicating the design um uh, we have one of information here go right there pick this guy all right it's gonna be white so we'll put it right there Right, so this is this is it. This is all we've got. All right, I can see that um, behind the lady, you can draw a line. Go here, pick white, pick white. Go to the size, reduce it to let's say two, um, and then go over here. Do this one, two. One, two, one. All right, done. Okay. All right, so the original design is not. All right, so this is it. We're done replicating the design. And how do you check it? I hope you find it very, very interesting. So we wanted to do this also. Right, so this is the design once you're done designing what you do now is to go over here and then save your projects all right all right so your project is saved you could save it as an image then take it over to snapseed or any other photo editor and then enhance your design but it's okay like this. So we could also add this. <coughs> Excuse me. We'll go to <coughs> Snapseed. I could make it uh, more real. All right. So first one to sharpness. All right. We can even stop it here. You can see that design is very cool save follow me for more tutorials design challenge continues tomorrow and i hope you'll be available to watch the tutorial to share it with your friend and to participate i will see you in another tutorial my name is niamoda don't forget to like this video and smash that subscribe button